What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel, uh, www.whatsupinthesky.com, and I'm going to show you the two Mars apps you need, especially if you're like a rock hound on Mars. I don't even know what to call us. We're like amateur archaeologists up there. I think it's more archaeology than anything else. Um, because what we're seeing up there is totally, totally ruins. So if you want to help, and a lot of people have done this, uh, I've given this, telling people about this, so I figured, you know, make a video and uh, show it to you guys. So the first one you can get on Android or on Apple iOS. I've got an iPad here, and uh, it's called Mars Images. Um, it's in the App Store. If you just go to the App Store, you can search Mars Images. It comes up number one. Download it. It's free, as, as which is cool. And uh, let's see. Check it out here. And what's neat is you can actually send me pictures from here. Like Dr. William, if you watch my videos, I imagine mostly just my subscribers will be watching this. If not, hit subscribe. We've got some really cool videos. Um, you can scroll through each one. And, and what's neat is if you hit this little rover button here, let's see. Yeah, you can change from opportunity to spirit. Um, and like I said, spirit only lasted so long, but opportunity is still pumping them out. You know, the last ones that came down were February 20. Let's look at this one right here. Front has cam. Takes a second to download it after you click on it. Let's see. And you can actually manipulate it, move in, move out. This looks like a night picture of it. Pretty interesting. I guess that's part of the herb right there. Um, here's another one. Let's try another picture. And so my internet's kind of slow here, but if you had really, really high speed internet, you could do this and just like zip right through this. Not a problem at all. So let's also, okay, let's go back here. Let me look at the Curiosity rover. Let me go back to it. And I'm going to show you how to do, like, send me something. So switch, switch, Curiosity. And uh, so what's neat is they're all there. And and this actually has them sometimes, let me get the oops, has them before, like, the website does. Like, I've actually gotten on here and then said, oh, man, this is awesome. Let me go find it on the NASA website. And this had it first. So I don't know if there's, like, an FTP site that this guy who made this gets it from. Um, I, I know the app was made by somebody. Um, I do believe, and there's, the next one I'm going to show you is really cool, especially if you just want to uh, check out what's going on on Mars, and uh, like you can actually drive the rover through the real pictures and find anomalies, so let's just uh, find us a picture with, uh, hopefully showing a little bit more forward. Alright, here we go. Alright, so you just tap on it like that, and then up here, you've, you've only got two things. You've got info, the little I button there, it's going to tell you exactly what it is, but you don't have to worry about that. What you want to do is hit this send and it's going to bring it up the little menu here and you hit you know message well mail if you want to send it to me through email so we're going to send it to email to will at will dot net and then uh, in here you can just tap it's just just your normal uh editor so it's going to send me the picture you type in something you know uh right area uh, you know, you just point it out. I have Dr. W, Dr. William, he puts in like quadrants. He breaks it into, you know, nine quadrants and we go by that. But just put, you know, it looks like the, the area, the rock on the right looks to have something on it or something like that. Or, you know, up in the mountains on the right side. Just just kind of briefly describe it to me. Hit send. Gone. So, like I said, that's a cool one. And you can do that, like I said, for any, all the cameras are there. And if you just keep scrolling, I mean, as long as your internet's fast, I mean, you can do this. Um, pretty much for, I mean, pretty much real time. I mean, it doesn't take long after the clicking to get these to come down. And they're the real resolution of them, too. That's what I kind of like about it. So you can look for anomalies and stuff like that and do the pinch. You pinch it in and kind of move it around. So, all right. Now, let me show you this next one. This next one's called Midnight Planets. Now, you can only get this for the Apple iOS. It works both on the iPhone and it works on this. So check this out. And uh, Midnight Planets, oops. It takes you into the rovers. It's kind of neat. You'll see what it, right when it comes up, what I'm talking about. Uh, okay, we're not going to rate this right now. So basically, I'm in the rover now, and you can basically use your fingers and move around. Let me show you all the neat things that it can do. See how I'm doing that here? I can zoom into these things, and uh, I can click on the next number here. This is all the same saw. So it tells you exactly. So it's what's neat about this, if you're really into figuring out what's going on um, if you take a picture and we can go take that picture and we know exactly what picture it is we can go to that place and we can see exactly where the rover was sitting on the map um, so let's see here let's go up to here this tier is neat you can hit the viewing um, let me go to the home page first 
because I do this for my 3D glasses, those uh, red cyan ones that we've had since we were kids. You can get them anywhere. Like if you pick up a DVD, usually they have four of them, a, a 3D DVD or something. That's how I got a whole bunch of them one time. But it, this is a free app too. You just got a couple ads on the bottom. And uh, here we go. Like if you want to ride in the opportunity or curiosity or spirit, you can do either one. And you just hit it, play, it comes into it. And what's next, what's neat about this is you can find the anomalies. I think it's going to take us where I've already been in the past. So the next, this button right here tells you, uh, you know, where you're at. We're at Salander Point. Now this one takes a little bit longer for the, uh, like if you're looking for speed, this one takes a while on my internet because it's slow. All right, let me pull back up the rover I want. I want the Curiosity rover. Opportunity is neat. They're still finding some stuff too. But I want to start at the beginning of the mission. Here we go. And just hit one. There we go. Bradbury Landing. Okay. All right. Mass Can Panorama. All right. We'll start like this. Now I'll show you how to actually send me the picture, or you know, like we did with the other one, or find out where it is on here. So it's just a panorama. Like I said, as you move in, it zooms in. It gets pretty good there. I mean, some of these have really good resolution. And back when this thing landed, it had much better resolution. I think that they're giving us now. Um, even out in the distance, look at this cool stuff here. So say you're interested in that, you do a little tap. You pull it out a little bit or you, you tap on it, see how it gives you that square? Uh, then you can hit the info button up at the top. And then you get these things right here, the left source image and the right source image. The right source image is usually a little bit bigger, I think, so hit that one. And then you're gonna get the picture up right here. It's like this, and you can even look at it like the other one. It doesn't let you get really big in it, but what it does, hit that button right there, the, uh, at the top right, the little send button, mail. Once again, will at willforar.net. And it's going to send me a link on this one, so I can just click it, you know, tell you, give me a nice little thing about it again. Will, oh shoot, willforar, you know what I mean. You know my email address, will at willforar.net. So anyway, those are the two. I think that one's, that one's pretty cool. I enjoy this one. So if you wanted to go moving along, you just tap. Let's see, we find out how the rover went. You can actually see the drive. So if you went to here... It would have to load them all up again. Up in the top right, that little thing going around in the corner there. That's like the loading up, slow down thing. But you can see how it's spaced out, how it's modeled out. The guy who made it, he really did a good job with it. Um, like I said, it kind of runs slow on my internet here. I don't have the fast. And the sad thing is I just had this internet upgraded, so go figure. The guy was just out. We ran a new line for the internet and the telephone. Let's see here. All right. I like this piece. You hit that button right there. This brings down, you can see the images. And like I said, you can bring, let's see, the sights. So it tells you how it went. You know, if you if you watch the uh, rover progress on the website, it basically gives, you know, here's Rock Nest up here. Let's go to Rock Nest. Where's the one? See, the, the, see Rock Nest sample? 10,000 images in this one. It's not going to pull them all up. It'll take me to it. See that count cache data? Come on. It's not going to give me anything now that I'm on the video doing it. But either way, if download it and play with it, it uh, it's definitely worth a shot trying to play with it and see. Let's see. I've got it right here. Airplay. Apple 3, hit the mirroring, turn this one off. Now I'm going to switch to my phone so you can see it on my phone. And you get the same thing here. Let's see, uh, Midnight Planets. Bam. Flip it, loading curiosity. Maybe my phone will work a little bit better than the other one did. Rock on, here we go. So wherever you're bored, wherever you are, as long as you've got some pretty decent internet speed, and this right here is running off of the... Uh, you know, outside telephone lines. I don't think I've got 4G here at my house for sure. I'm like uh, 3G, some something like that. So anyway, then the same thing. Once you find something you want to send, tap on it, hit the info button um, here on the phone. It's up here at the top. And then you're going to get the source images. Take the source image. If there's only one, take that one. Hit the send button. Bam! Send it on over, guys. What's up in the sky, 37? I hope you enjoy these. And then don't forget the other one, Mars Images. Go ahead and hook me up. Send me those things. I can't wait to see what you guys got. 
put a little description in. Like I said, I, I know that there's a bunch of you who look at pictures, and now you're going to have something. You can do it from anywhere. You don't have to be sitting in front of your computer. So that's what's nice for me. Much love, guys. Take it easy. Peace.